And hello there, guys. Gamer Weasel back with my new short little walkthrough. Why is it so colorful? Why is the sun smiling? Why are all the games I'm doing so colorful? Well, because I like it. Well, I don't know why, but I guess I'm just doing this to pass the time until I get the game that I ordered which I'm not gonna say what it is <laughs> so you'll just have to figure that one out but in the meantime welcome to the over the hedge playthrough mm -hmm. maybe going inside a human's house wasn't such a good idea I wanna eat I want food food is what you'll get hamster enough food to fill a barricade hopefully okay everyone pay attention oh look at the light we need to get through the next three yards everyone knows your roles right Heather and I run along the front of the house and come in through the how come everybody looks like they're on cocaine we resist the urge to faint so we can warn everyone right oh right Lou, Penny, you'll meet us at the house? Just me. Penny will stay home with the little ones. Oh, jeepers. I don't want you by yourself in a human house there. But we do this together. Hamilton? Where to go, huh? You and Stella meet us at the hole in the fence in the third yard, right? Right. Third yard, yep. Three comes after six, right? <laughs> Stella? Help Hammy count to three. Got it. Vern and I will navigate the three yards full of the most devious human traps imaginable, sticking to the shadows like creatures of the night, sneaking past incredible dangers, and... Sometime before the sun comes up would be good. Right. Everyone ready? Good luck, everyone, and be careful! Okay, use the frog statue to open the gate, break five birdhouses, meet still by the gate wow. in the last yard. All right. I have to say, this doesn't look so bad. Great, let's move out! Meh, it could be worse. Yeah, this is a very therapeutical game. You just beat the living shit out of everything, you know? Okay. 20 cookies give you more energy. Or in other words, a speed. Oh yeah, that's how we'd be all sneaky like. Yeah, I'm, I feel like doing it just for the hell of it. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Oh, right, <laughs> come on. That too, but I meant stepping into the light. Looks like some kind of amphibian. Wouldn't a turtle be less cliche? Let's find ourselves a frog then. How hard could it be? Aren't turtles just like demented shelled frogs or something like that? Something along those freaking lines. Gonna beat the shit out of you, Vern. Then we. Oh look, we oh. expected. Who's up for a snack? Uh, them, I predict. Oh no, he's wielding a chicken leg. Picnic tables. Poultry alert. Pan out. Watch the show. Enemy meat raccoon. Sweet chips. Yeah. This teaches kids modern post deconstructionalism. Whatever that means. Okay, yes. Okay. Chips, I love them. Yeah. Stupid frog. Ooh, C D. Collect DVDs to unlock extras. Yes. You both have a lot to learn about birds, don't ya? Don't ya? You don't want a piece of me, Tweety. Seriously. You wouldn't want to see my friend here bluster and fume, would you? Look, people, I don't make the rules. You want into the next yard, you need my help. Sorry, guys. City ordinance. We're all slaves to bureaucracy. That's what separates us from the humans. Uh, yeah. Very thoughtful. Uh. Thank you. What do we have to do to get past? Uh. Bureaucracy that. I got the key for the gate hidden in one of those objects. Break them until you find it. Oh, we get to break stuff? 
Why didn't you say so? Tutorial. Well, anyways. Oh, look, there's a dog's ass. Okay. Anyways. I'm really happy with what you guys did with the Neopets the Darkest Fairy walkthrough. It's gotten a lot more attention than I expected. And yeah, it's j I'm glad it's been a real help to everyone. <laughs> Yeah, that's got me a lot of positive responses. Zaki, whoever hides keys in birdhouses happens to have some problems, in my opinion. DVD, some cookies. Yes, RJ. Yes. I have the force. Burn, freeze. All this fuss over us? I just don't get human priorities. It's the sniffer. The cranky ones pay him to deal with us. Although not that well based on the quality of these trap designs. What do you think we are, insects? Now come on, and stay low. Stay low. Hmm, but... Isn't it inconvenient we have to jump over things if we want to stay low? Yeah, I'll just let Vern get beat the hell up while I get all the goodies. Mmm, pizza, pizza, num, 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 num. Yes, I know how to double jump. Wee. Ah, here she is. Ready, Stella? Yeah, but this better be one stupid cat. Never trick it, a laser. Oh man, they were still beating our asses when we got there. But that was pretty easy. Don't set off a single alarm, disarm the traps, toss food to Penny. Boy, this kind of makes me want to get a log with a higher roof. And carpet. Amen. Now let's disable the traps so we can admire all this without that whole fear of death thing. Ah, just what the disarmament doctor ordered. I think it's funny that they would put the box to disarm all the traps within reach of, hmm, let's say, animals. Oh, got my awesome chef hat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> ah, another DVD. Hey! Oh, I'm getting dizzy just looking at this thing. I'll handle this, Hammy. Where's my cookie? You just said cookie, right? Either way, where is it? There's plenty of cookies in it for you, Hammy. All you have to do is just follow the bouncing light and push the buttons, and cookies will rain down from the heavens like... Birthday cakes? Wedding cakes, but only if you hop to it. Yes. I did it! I did it! Sweet. Where's my wedding cakes? Guys, we only have a few minutes until the humans wake up. So whatever we're doing, can we do it a few minutes faster? Heather's right. Penny and Lou, you take the front door. Hammy and Stella, you've got the hallway. Vern, me and you'll cover the kitchen. Run away! Move your fat ass, Vern, move! Oh, Chip. Hey. Now it's one big tub of ice cream, or whatever that is. Holy crap. Oh, I'll we'll have some up to you there in a minute, hon. <sighs> go, go, go! Move it, Vern! <laughs> 